friends welcome or welcome back to my channel today we are going to talk about breakfast lunch and dinner as you probably remember there are three main meals a day first we eat breakfast next we eat lunch and finally we eat dinner Let's take a look at some things we know about breakfast. Breakfast is the first meal we eat in a day. Did you know that intentionally not eating for a period of time is called a fast? Breakfast means to break the fast that you participated in while you were sleeping. Break fast breakfast. It is said that breakfast is the most important meal of the day. Why do you think that is? Breakfast is the most important meal of the day because it replenishes the nutrients you missed out on while you were asleep and gives you energy to take on a new day. Do you know what some popular foods that people like to eat for breakfast are? Let's take a look together. People really like to eat cereal in the morning. And while some people like their cereal dry, most eat their cereal with milk. Pancakes with butter and syrup are another breakfast favorite. Waffles are also good. They taste a lot like pancakes, don't you think? Of course, bacon is another very popular choice of breakfast meat. Another popular breakfast meat choice is sausage, links, or patties. And sometimes people like to eat plain toast in the morning, do you? Plain toast is good, but I would much rather have toast with jam on it. And I bet, unless you're allergic, you've had hard or soft boiled eggs at least once for breakfast. Or maybe you prefer your eggs fried or even scrambled. Pastries like croissants and muffins are another really popular breakfast choice. And of course, we can't forget having donuts for breakfast, yum. A lot of people really like to eat fruit with their cereal or oatmeal or on its own. Of course, fruit juice like grape, orange, and apple are a great way to start your morning. Yogurt is a quick, easy, and healthy breakfast when you're in a hurry in the morning. A very popular breakfast item is a smoothie with fruit or protein. A lot of people really like oatmeal with fruit and sugar on the top. All right, friends, are you ready to talk about lunch? Lunch is the midday meal. Lunch is important for everyone, but it's really important for the school day and the work day. Do you know why it's so important? The first reason is that lunch gives you a break in your day so that you have a moment to rest. The second reason is if you work with people or you go to school, eating lunch together gives you a time to socialize with your friends. In the United States, the sandwich is the most popular food to have at lunch. Salads are also a very popular, quick, and healthy lunchtime food. Let's look at some more lunchtime foods, shall we? I bet almost everyone has had a hamburger for lunch. And of course, if you've had a hamburger, you've probably had french fries. And how many of you have had a hot dog for lunch with so many toppings? And one of my favorite things to eat with a hot dog are onion rings, yum. And I bet everyone has probably had pizza for lunch at least one time in their life, right? Does your work or school have something called Taco Tuesdays? Tacos are fantastic. Chicken nuggets are also a great lunch. Do you dip your chicken nuggets in anything? I love ranch and honey mustard. 
Maybe you've had a fried chicken for lunch. Oh, and soup is one of my favorite things to have for lunch, especially on a really cold day. And maybe with your main meal, you might have chips or you might have chopped veggies. And do you like having a dessert with your lunch? Maybe your grown-up packs you a cookie. Or maybe you get ice cream at school. All right, now let's talk about dinner. Dinner is the last meal of the day. And did you know that dinner is also sometimes called supper? Dinner is often the main time that families eat together at the end of a work or school day. Dinner is also usually the most formal of the three meals. All right, now let's talk about foods you might eat for dinner. Steak is a very popular food to be eaten at dinner time. Of course, if you eat steak, you're probably also going to eat potatoes. Salmon is a great fish to have for dinner. It's really good for your heart. There are so many kinds of noodle dishes you might also have for dinner. A hot pot is kind of a noodle dish that you add meat to. Shrimp is also a very popular dinner item. I love shrimp. And have you ever eaten surf and turf? Surf and turf means a fish and a land animal. Lobster is another very fancy and expensive item you might eat for dinner. Crab is also a fantastic and my favorite dinner option. A lot of people really enjoy eating sushi for dinner. I'm learning to like sushi. Of course, there are so many varieties of pasta that you can make for dinner. Baked chicken is a pretty affordable and easy, nice dinner option. Ribs is a great dinner option. In fact, I'm having ribs for dinner tonight. Ham is an especially popular dinner item around the holidays. And I don't know about you, but I love eating dumplings for dinner. Yum! And what's a nice dinner without a dessert? Like you might have a cake. You might also enjoy some pie at the end of your meal. What are some of your favorite foods to eat? Did they make the list? I bet some of them did, didn't they? I'm so glad you came to my classroom today. If you like this video, give me a thumbs up and subscribe to come back to my classroom again. I'll see you soon. Bye, friends.